you guys, I love y'all so much. And y'all know that I, I freaking tell y'all that every time I see y'all, I'm just like, they're just so full of joy. If you have not had the pleasure to meet Noelle and Dan in person, I want you to know some things. One, you might be a little intimidated because Noelle's got muscles and she, <clears throat> but she'll, she'll squeeze you in a hug before she ever beats you up. Right. <laughs> Um, she's a bodybuilder and she's going to tell you about that story or she was a bodybuilder. She did some competitions and then you have Dan, Dan has an incredible story, not just with the Lord, but in his business and his life. And he's going to share that. It's not my story to tell. Um, but the thing about both of them is like, people like to see a book on the outside, right? You see the, you see the cover and you think oh, I've read that book. I've seen that chapter. I've, I know that how that ends, but you don't. Because God is good and Plexus is great and people are crazy. And I love people so much because it leads to something like this, like the Plexus opportunity. And um, it led me to friends like Noel and Dan. And no, we are not affiliated in any way on the same team. We're just friends. And my oldest son is nine. I shared that testimony last week um, and has just been a, spe he has, he gets a twinkle in his eye around Noel. I mean, who wouldn't, but like, he's just loves her. And when we have Plexus events, if you've ever been to a Plexus event, put it in the chat. Like there ain't no party like a Plexus party, right? Um, there's DJs, there's lights, there's music. And you will always find Daniel, um, Daniel. I'm like, you always find Daniel, not necessarily true, but you always find Noelle on the dance floor because she's so full of joy and it's contagious. And my nine-year-old found her <laughs> and it was so precious. And he actually found her like what, three years ago. And so now it's like this thing where he's like, where's my girlfriend? Where's Noelle? Where's Noelle? And now they seek each other out at Plexus events and it's like a happy reunion. It's really cool. It's so precious. So that's how I know them. Other than that, they were complete strangers to me outside of Plexus. So I love this opportunity and how you get to hear stories like this today. So without further ado, Noelle, Dan, do what you do best and <laughs> allow people to drink really big for the next 15 minutes and believe in themselves harder than they've ever believed, believe in the Lord more than they ever have in their life, because that is what your story has done for me. And I cannot wait for them to hear it. Oh, thank you. Oh, we just love you. So I just much. teared up. I have to tell you guys, I remember watching Emily's like zooms and, and growing and learning from her YouTubes. And then I just lucked out that her son became my boyfriend. So <laughs> I had an in. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, all right, I'm gonna try and go fast because I feel like Dan's business story is even bigger than mine. Do you want health and business or just business? Let's just do business. Show me the money, girl. Okay, mm -hmm. all right. So I got a little bit nervous because I share my health testimony on like a daily, mm -hmm. but I don't often share my business story. Um, I actually became a counselor because I felt like at 28, Jesus told me I was supposed to help people. And I, here I am going, I'm a hot mess. Who on earth can I help? So I went and became a counselor and I'm like, I'm going to help so many people. Well, um, I had my daughter and my ex-husband and I didn't want me to leave her. So I was just volunteering, counseling, postpartum depression, new moms, because I could bring my baby with me. But anyway, I stopped doing that and I quickly lost all my purpose. I became a codependent uh, Italian housewife, which was not my calling, where I was supposed to cook and clean and be a good wife and mom. And I hated my life. I developed a really big drinking problem. I was very, I had already struggled with depression my whole life, but that's not, I'm not doing a health testimony here. I was at a point though, where I had no purpose. I lost that light and that spark inside me. And I was like, what happened to this girl who I might cry, sorry guys, but what happened to this girl that was supposed to change the world, right? So let's fast forward to the point where my ex-husband did well, but he was very much, his money was his money. So I would go to him and I'd be like, hey, I need to get some toiletries. And he's like, you need $50 for toiletries. And I'm like, I'd love, I was trying to learn how to do my own nails because I couldn't have my nails done. And I sat home all day thinking this is my life, right? Um, well, he really loved the idea of network marketing. So his best friend had a six figure earner for a mom. And so he kept signing me up for these network marketing companies. And I was like, people would call me and be like, what's this face cream? I'd be like, save your money. Don't buy it. Like I was the worst salesperson. I was the worst network marketer. And I kept telling him, I'm not, I'm not meant for sales. This is not me. And he's like, but you love people and you talk to everyone. I'm like, I don't want to sell anything. That was my stance. So if any of you guys are those skeptical people, that was me. 
So when fast forward, right, my daughter's five, I was in terrible health problems, everything from weight to IBS to allergies to all the things, pain, depression. And I remember my ex-husband telling me that he found something that was going to help me. And it was some gut health. And I laughed in his face and I was like, that's not going to help me. And he said, ah, oh, it's only a hundred dollars. You may as well try this. And I said, that's too cheap to help me because I'm like lots and lots of money in debt for all of my health problems. So I was like, fine, for a hundred bucks, dude, I would have stood on my head in a dog poop if you asked me to, whatever, to fix it. So I started taking it to prove him wrong. But he told me it was network marketing. And I was like, you asked me to sell this stuff, I will punch you in the face. And like Emily said, I'm a lover. I've never hit anyone, but I meant it. I was like, no more network marketing. So he tells me, my friend from high school swears by this. I'm like, fine, let me take this stuff, right? So I start taking it, and for me, it was very fast. I start feeling amazing, and I'm like, okay, let me talk to this girl from high school. First thing I told her was, I will never sell this stuff. She tells everyone now, like I threatened her. Don't ever ask me to sell it, but I do like having friends, so you can be my friend. Well, fast forward over um, about a month, I would say, every person was like, what are you doing? Like I was telling people, it's legal. It works, it's natural, I don't know, but it's legal because I'd had a shady past. And here I was bouncing around these workouts I used to cry through, my body's changing, my attitude's changing. And I told my ex-husband, he's like, well, why don't you sell this stuff? I'm like, my purpose from God is to help people. And he said, You're, you were a depressed counselor on the couch. Like, who were you helping? And that took a little stab to the heart, right? I cried my eyes out that night, but I woke up and I was like, he's right. I wasn't helping anyone. So I started letting a few people order, right? Like I was like, oh, it's legal. It works. You want some? Fine. I went senior gold in two months. I signed like 50 people and I had a room full of people wanting to share this stuff. And not because I wanted to make six figures one day like I do, but because I was excited I could help people. I had found the gift God gave me. I was in six months of prayer before God gave me this gift and I knew he was faithful. I had a way to help people. And then I heard that there was a Hawaii trip attached to it somewhere down the road. And guys, I'm a blue personality. I was like, I'm going to Hawaii, right? Granted, it took me five years to get to Hawaii, but man, that was worth it. But in the meantime, I went on lots of trips. Like that next month, I went to Arizona and my ex-husband goes, how are you going to afford that? I'm like, I don't know. I'm going to put on a credit card. It's convention. I'm going to this Phoenix thing. It was 2015 and I was going to be there. And I got off the plane and I used to work with celebrities. Celebrities don't phase me, but I saw Christy Hall, Rebecca Folks, and Timmy Yancey who like, I watched their YouTube videos and I hung out with them for like two days. I was trying to grow on them like fungus. And I was seeing this vision of what my life could be for the first time. And I went home and I went to this event at church and they were building a well in Africa. And I looked at the money I had made in the last couple months and it was more than I made as a counselor ever. And I was like, I'm gonna build a well in Africa. And I like wrote this check and I put from my Plexus team and I was so proud and I was crying and I was so like, this is what Jesus wanted for me, right? To help the people and to then pay it forward. So as the time comes, right? Like things are going on. I'm doing really well, but I had a purpose. And I swear, guys, I thought I had a ton of friends because I was a social person. I had no friends because I had no supportive people. I wasn't the person who had their mom, their brother, and their sister all join them. I was the one who everyone laughed at, made fun of, and told me I'd never go anywhere with this. But I was like, no, I'm going to help people. And I tell you, that passion, that purpose, I never let it dull my, like no matter what people brought at me, I kept going. So Anyway, I came to the point where there was a church that wanted to be planted that was all about helping sinners, and that was like my passion. And I asked my ex-husband if he'd match me, and I took the money I made for a year in Plexus, and I got to help plant a church. But then further come along, my ex-husband's my best friend, guys. He gave me Plexus. He tells me I gave him Jesus and self-development. We're best friends. But I had for years cried because I didn't think I was in the right marriage, but I couldn't afford to leave him. So now is the place where I'm going to get divorced and, and my empowerment coach is like, can you make it on your own? I go, I want peace. I don't want any of his money because I want peace. And I love my ex-husband, but if I take his money, he's going to be mad. So my, my uh, empowerment coach is like, you think you can do this? I'm like, all I have to do is go Emerald. And I've never had a push to get there because I never cared about six figures. But now I was like, I'm going to do this. So I went Emerald shortly after I got divorced. Um, my ex-husband is still my number one first and best ambassador, and it helped him with his entire blood disorder, so I'm grateful. Um, and I'm going to let Dan go into his. I kept it under seven minutes so he could have seven, too. That's why I was talking so fast. I'm not that good at summing things up. 
But my first interaction with Dan was I met him in a bar and I was trying to get him on my Plexus team and he was telling mm -hmm. me it was a felon and he couldn't get a job. <laughs> this is true. And she had a monkey on her in a bar. I'm like, what's going on? <laughs> and I was one of the monkey and then I got a monkey. Long story <laughs> short. But, uh, but yeah, guys, so that picture on the left, as you can see, uh, I'm an ex-con, ex cat's out of the bag, right? Um, and I'm going to try to be vulnerable today and I'm going to open up my heart and just be real with you. Um, I have a pretty dark past, and I'm sure some of you have the same thing going on as well. And that past haunted me for a long time, right? Um, spent three years in prison at 17 years old, uh, overcame drug addiction, uh, glory to God, right? And with that being said, I struggled, I couldn't get an opportunity. Nobody would hire me, um, didn't matter what education I had, what skills I had, people would not hire me, I could not get a job. Um, fast forward to five and a half years ago. I was living in a 500 square foot apartment filled, filled with hundreds of cockroaches, if not thousands. And uh, I was at my, my last wit's end and I just wanted to give up on life and I couldn't take it anymore. I was just defeated and broken, right? And broke at, at that. And so I had a gun to my head and I was ready to just give up and throw in the towel multiple times, uh, sitting on the floor with a loaded gun on my head, just like, God, I can't do it. And uh, it's, it's bring me back to those moments talking about it, right? And uh, Two weeks later, I was like, God, I won't, I won't do it this time, but just give me a sign. I need help. I need you. Two weeks later, she comes into my life again. After, <laughs> after didn't even tell you a year ago, I was like, I'm not doing this. this. This isn't for me when I met her in the bar, right? I was like, I can't do that. I don't have the skills. I hate people. I hate myself. I can't do it. It's, it's not me, right? I'm not a network marketer. And then, uh, so go back to that time. And she comes into my life and I'm, I'm her personal trainer and, and I get her ready for a competition, right? And then, little behold, I uh, ended up taking the products because she wanted to win an iPad. And that's how most men start in this business. If you don't know that, um, you just got to give them the products and say, take this, right? <laughs> and so, uh, so I started taking the products. And, and little did I know, within a month, I started to feel happy for the first time for no reason. I didn't need drugs. I didn't need exercise. I was just naturally happy. And I was like, what is this? So I started to learn about gut health. I didn't know about gut health. And I know this is like the, the testimony for products and whatnot, but... But it changed my life because of because of what it did to my brain, right? And because 95% of your serotonin comes from your gut. I started to learn all about it. And then uh, I started to look into the business, right? At first he said no, and he came to convention. Oh, that too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to sum it all up. There's so many moving parts here. But, uh, <laughs> but yeah, it's crazy how God works, right? Let me go to that, actually. So I said no. I was taking the products for about four months, five months. I go to a convention, my first convention in Las Vegas, 2019, and uh, Connie Schutz, I always butcher her last name, she, she doesn't like that, but I'm sorry, she, sorry Connie. But uh, Connie Schutz, she, she was the first speaker, and she was on stage as a diamond talking about how she spent, I think, four years in prison or something, the first speaker out there, and I'm like, Noel, did you set this up? I'm like, I don't have that like, kind of going on? <laughs> so I was like, okay, if she can do it, I can do it. And and I went home and I was just like, I'm ready. So we sat down I was like, how can we do this? We, we created a strategy and we just started crushing it. I want Emerald in a year, guys. I double ranked in June, I double ranked. I went, uh, was it Ruby and then Senior Ruby? And then by November, I was Emerald. And, uh, and I was crushing it. I was on fire because of what this opportunity has for everyone. It doesn't matter who you are, where you come from, as long as you're 18 years old and you live in the United States, Canada, Mexico, Australia, New Zealand, you can do this, guys. If I can do this coming from where I come from, you can do it. Honestly, like I was broken. I didn't have the right mindset. Um, who I was four and a half years ago from when I started is a completely different person, completely different. I used to hate speaking in front of people. I'd get nervous talking to one person, let alone uh, 2,500 for my first time speaking on stage in, in that picture right there, my first time speaking on stage in front of 2,500 people. I almost pooped my pants, um, to be honest, but I didn't, and I did great, so thank God for that. But God God has been behind me in my entire journey, and uh, there's still a lot of work I gotta do for him, and glory to God, and I love this company, and I love the people, and it's transformed my life completely, and it brought me a wife, would you believe that? <laughs> I'm, I'm being honest, guys. Not saying that's gonna guarantee a wife for every man out there, but it happened for me. Um, but it's it's been so so amazing. Mm. The people here, like like Emily, Emily, we love you so much, and she's just one of the amazing people that are a part of this company, right? The mm -hmm. community is just so important, so supportive, and just so loving, and they want to lift you up and you rise together. It doesn't matter what team you're on, you don't you don't have to benefit from each other to work together, right? Like that's what I love about this. 
and the opportunities for everyone. And if you want to come to Punta Cana, let's go because I'm I'm coming there too, right? We're going on that cruise as well, right, Emily? Yeah, we are, yeah. We are obsessed with travel. We got married at the Hawaii trip last mm -hmm. year, and it was such a blessing. Like we got a wedding on Plexus's dime, not even. <laughs> now they didn't pay for the actual wedding. Don't. don't no, that you're one. good. You guys, like this is what I was trying to like set up. Like, and it's so you can't the joy that just. It's so contagious. And, you know, I just, y'all's story is so special to me from personal family members that I think of that just need to hear it from other people that we don't even know yet that need to hear your, your story, Dan, even your story, Noel. There's so many people that feel trapped and stuck and that they just, there's, there's nothing left for them here or they have no passion or where do you go find passion? And, um, a lot of them don't even know the Lord. And so your story touches on so many things as people struggle with. And then if y'all watching this, if y'all yeah. can't like feel the joy through their smiles and their stories and that they freaking mean what they say, like you weren't listening, you weren't paying attention. Like, and they're like this all the time, just for the record. And her monkey is like, they're just like crawl out of her lap in the middle of a meeting. Like she really does have a pet monkey. I should have put it in the slide. <laughs> I but, brought it out here and Dan said he distracts him too much. Oh yeah, I know. Like, it's okay. It's so cute monkey. though. Head and everything. Like, well, you can find both of them on social media, on Facebook and Instagram. You can follow their story, share their stories, and obviously run alongside them to Punta Cana. I'm so excited about this incentive trip. Thank you both for sharing. Uh, I seriously can I share one last thing. Yeah, share away. One last thing, because my dad passed away two years ago, and I feel like every day I get to honor him now, because when I was growing up, he used to tell me, you need to work for yourself so you have freedom to travel and do what you want to do, but you can't have a business that then they need you to be there all the time. And he used to take me on these big trips of self-development and parties they'd celebrate. It was called Young President's Organization. I'm like, I'm going to be president of a company. And then I got to high school and I was a terrible student and I'm ADD. And I'm like, I'm not going to be president of a company. And I was defeated. When I went on my first Plexus trip, I was like, dad, you would be so proud. Like, I figured it out. <laughs> so it was fun. I love that so much. I love that. I love that for you. I'm so proud of you guys. This is so cool. I can't wait to see what's in store for the, this last quarter of the year for y'all and just everything that Plexus presented us today. It's the first of the month. What are y'all going to do? So this is this is where I get to take over this part of the, the show. Dan and all y'all are more than welcome to stay on or if you got to get off, y'all got to go. We love you and thank you for sharing. Okay, you guys, let's keep this party going. It's time to show you the money. So you just heard a real life story, not from one, but two guests. I love that we kind of changed it up. I love that we had Dan on because it's not often we have a me ambassador in the house. It's like, let me, let me get vulnerable. Like I swear that's like in romance novels only. Right. And so thank you, Dan, for getting vulnerable and just going there. Meanwhile, my husband is getting out tactical gear in front of me. You can't see him, <laughs> but we're going to talk about why you, why not you? I had to think about that question that I ask y'all every Friday because a lot of you get on and you're, you're a part of Plexus, but you, you're curious about the business side. You're like, could I really make money? Are these stories really true? Does Noel and like, do Noel and Dan really make money? Does Emily really make money? Like we really make money. We really get deposits 10 times a month for me and my husband. We both work Plexus also. Scott is an Emerald ambassador and I'm a diamond ambassador. So when I, Sit there and I'm like, you want to come wave so they can know you're a real life person? I'm real. Okay, he's real. Um, So here's the thing. He's usually not home on Fridays. Remember last week he scared me? Okay, why not you? So like Noelle said, she was like, who am I? Who am I to go lead people and help people? Although her other thought was, I'm, I know I'm here to help people. Does so anybody else relate to that? Speak up. I have never felt that so more as a mom than any other time in my life where I was like, I know I was put on this planet to be a mom, but being a mom is the hardest thing on the planet I've ever done, right? Well, I feel like in network marketing, it's just like that. I want to help people. I want to make money, but why is this so dang hard? So it doesn't have to be. Did you know statistics show that if someone knew they could just make three to $500 in their first 30 days, in network marketing, no matter the company, no matter the product, they could just make, they just knew they can make three to $500 that they would do it. They would actually have a willingness to try. The studies show that, the surveys show that. The proof is there. 
So as ambassadors and as skeptics that are here today, they're like, mm, I don't know about this. I'm, I just have so many questions. Why not you? It'd be silly for you not to. We live in an e-commerce e-commerce world. You get on Instagram, you get on TikTok. Someone's doing a dance and talking about their favorite toothpaste. Somebody is on there talking about their brand new washing machine because they partnered with Home Depot. Well, you know what? We partnered with a gut health company that is USA made out of Arizona with incredible products. We have incredible gut health products. We are um, founded in gut health and experts in microbiome because you have microbiomes all over your body. And this is not a health call. This is a business call. Here's the thing. We know the products work. You just saw Noel's before and after y'all seen my before and after you've seen other people's before and after that come on every Friday and share like the products work. All right. They're extra. They're extra. Well, I'm here to tell you guys is, okay, so how do I earn the $300 in 30 days? I'm so glad you asked. Do you know three people? Do you know three people? Okay. How do I begin? Well, let's go. Let's dig in. Okay. So for those of you that are like, okay, I know three people or like, maybe you're like me, you find yourself at a sports field all weekend long. Like I sacrifice my weekend so my kids can do what they love and I can network my business. Okay. So some questions I want you to ask yourself. I don't want to ask you. I want you to talk to yourself. It's okay. I know we're a little crazy. Sorry. Talk to yourself and say, why would I be good at this? And I I'm already on social media. I referred like three moms, my Starbucks order. I told that one mom what I bought at Walmart last week. I shared my my paint swatch in my living room with my neighbor. Like I'm constantly referring things to people. Would I be excellent at sharing Plexus gut health supplements too? Of course you would. Why would you not take vitamins and get paid to take your vitamins? I mean, my doctor ain't calling me like, hey girl, here's $20 because you came to your appointment. Home Depot isn't calling me and offering me money because I posted what color paint I painted my walls. Starbucks, Nope, never. I tell everyone to get a white mocha and add hazelnut and it's like a dessert. It is the most delicious coffee. Starbucks has paid me $0 to tell you all that. $0, $0. But every time I refer Plexus to someone, I'm making over $35 for every single one that signs up. You can do that too. But I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. What if I'm not a salesperson? Uh, Noelle's not a salesperson. She literally told us that. She literally said, I hate network marketing. I don't want to do that. I love that she said that and I have it recorded forever. It's amazing. <laughs> but like, what if I'm not a salesperson? Okay, where my mom's at. How many of you sell your kids on bedtime every night? Listen, if you just go to bed right now, you're going to wake up and you're going to grow and your bones get rest and you're going to go superpowers or whatever we have to tell our kids to go to bed at night. Okay, what about, what about where my married people at? How many of you have to sell your husband on the idea of a dog? Babe, I'll, I'll feed him and I'll water him and or a monkey in Noel's case. Like, can we just please get a monkey? You know, like think about the things you are selling to the people you love already. You are a salesperson. It's in our blood. It's natural to refer things that we love and that we get passionate behind. Okay, the last thing that usually comes up is like, okay, I'm too busy. Ooh. Ooh, I'm too busy too. I got three kids. I'm outnumbered. We got sports practice every day after school. Then, and then on top of a husband and a dog, and I work three plexus businesses with my spouse. I'm busy too. He runs a government job and another business he started because of our plexus income. Girl, I got your busy times 10. But you know what I love about busy people? For those of you that join me every Friday, what do I love about busy people? If you want to put it in the chat, Put it in the chat. I'm so glad y'all are here, busy people, because that means you have a large network. You know how to prioritize things. You know how to multitask. Those things, those three things right there make a perfect Plexus ambassador. And so the last thing I want to leave you with is some of you are struggling to find that passion in motherhood or in life, or maybe you're in your 40s and 50s and you're like, I ain't 27 anymore. I'm not 17 anymore. Okay, no, you're not. And so Jessica, that picture in the middle, Jessica is an Emerald ambassador on my team and she's a mom. She was a struggling alcoholic and she missed the first five years of her oldest daughter's life because of addiction. And Plexus has completely restored her health, her mindset, and has allowed personal growth so that she can be present and sober. And the possibilities are endless of what she's able to do with her Plexus money and her time to work from home and be in her kids' lives. There's a real life friend of mine. She's on my Facebook. You don't believe me. I get it. I get it. I'm skeptical too. Go, Jessica Ruckle. She's a real life girl. And then we have Lindsay. Lindsay shared actually a couple of weeks ago. Jessica is going to share next week. We're going to pre record the call because we're going to be in Mexico with Plexus. So you'll get Jessica's pre recorded call link next week. 
But Lindsay was also somebody that shared. She's also on my team. And she talked about being a military spouse. And she was so sick and tired. She couldn't get off the couch. She couldn't play with her kids. She didn't want to talk to her husband. And she said, I just knew if I could find a way to bring an extra $200 a month, I could get the necessary health care to advocate for myself. She wanted a holistic doctor. She just knew if she could make a little bit of money, she could find answers for her health. And then she found so much more in our products. So for those of you that are like, I'm busy, I'm not a salesperson. Great. I'm so glad you're here. Keep watching. So here's the thing. I said, do you know three people? Did you hear me say that? Because that's the power of social sharing. You plus three, when you use your referral link three times in the next 30 days, you can make over $300 in bonuses. And then that's the first Plexus rank up. You're going to get recognized. You're going to get a certificate in the mail and a pin. And people are going to shout you out on the internet. Like it's a family reunion. You're going to be like, I don't know you, Tommy, but thanks. Like you're just going to get all these comments because people celebrate your success here. Three referrals. That could be like you referring the gut health system, you referring the weight loss system. We have amazing gut health skincare, referring that. Maybe you're training for a marathon like me. I don't know why, but me and Scott are training for this marathon in the fall and I need all the active and hydrate I can get my hands on. So I'm referring that like crazy to my other running friends. Like, hey, you need to get your hands on the supplements. I refer three people. I'm going to make money. You have to make the sell. Just like you sold your kid on bedtime. Did they eventually go to sleep? Did they tell you no a hundred times? Yes. But did they eventually go to sleep? That's how I feel about this business model. They're going to say no. It's not going to be great timing for them. But when the timing is right and they do go to that doctor's appointment or they check their bank account or their kid wants to do select baseball or their debt is crippling them and they're like in that moment of despair, but also hopefulness because they have a friend that told them about a business opportunity, then they're going to be like, oh, I have an option. And they're going to remember me plus three. And it's cute because it rhymes, right? So if you're still here in the chat, which rank on the right would make a difference for your family? It goes from silver to diamond. We got silver, senior silver, gold, senior gold, ruby, senior ruby, emerald, sapphire, and diamond. Here's the thing. Plexus makes zero income guarantees. All right. There's no, we're not salary here. You do the work and your paycheck will reflect the work. Okay. And so here on average, the average annual income of a Plexus ambassador is $544. That's on our income disclosure statement. I do not care what that amount is. That just is proof that this works when you work it. If you go and refer it with a friend, you go and make money. Our comp plan is the best in the industry with room to grow as much as you're willing to work for it. There's no limit on your potential earnings. I have friends in this company that make six figures a month, a month. And I'm happy for them. I'm, there's no jealousy there. I'm elated that that is available to me too. That that is possible for my family too. And of course I can work towards that. I can learn some new skills. I can use social media, right? How many of you are on Instagram right now? How many of you are talking about your favorite nail salon or the infamous Stanley cup? I feel like I see that in every other post on the internet, or I have another thing, uh, a belt bag. How many of you bought a belt bag from an, Am- from an Amazon influencer? Cause it showed up on your Instagram feed, right? We're constantly referring things to people. Why not vitamins? Why not helping people see the potential? What rank would make a difference in your life? Let's go. Let's work towards it. Um, This is my friend, Trisha. She has seven kids. She is a Plexus Diamond. Her husband is a Emerald. And in the last 67 days, she actually just re-ranked to this right here, Senior Ruby. And what do I mean by that? In the Plexus Compensation Plan, when you get to the top of the company, you can do it all over again. 2.0. So basically, I'm going to sign up as myself and be my own customer and grow a business again. So yes, it's like double dipping and it's allowed here and we love it. So Trisha went senior Ruby in 65 days. Dang, dang, I know it's a lot. And she's woo, so good, I love it. So here's what I know about Trisha. Trisha is a no negativity allowed mama. Like I know you're thinking like, that's ridiculous. She has seven kids, of course there's negativity. No. Her family is so joyful and they work hard and they just don't allow that type of negativity. They, she puts her blinders on is what I call it. And she gets to work and she tells everyone kind of like what Dan said. He's like, if you're 18 and you live in the following four countries, you can do this. Like Trish is the same way. She's like, don't tell me you can't don't give me the reason that your excuses not to are usually the reasons why to half the time your excuses are usually the reason why you should. And Trish is a great example of that. So I love sharing that. 
That is my Plexus Lexus on the right. Did you know you can earn a car? I love that Noel brought up the Hawaii trip and the car. You can earn a Plexus Lexus or a lifestyle bonus when you have 300 customers that are reordering or signing up in a calendar month. I know it sounds like a big number, but um, that's a whole elementary school. If you play your cards right and you talk and you develop relationships in your community and you meet all these families at the elementary school, I guarantee you there's 300 families there. Imagine changing your whole community's life. I would I just love it. So you're creating residual income. You're earning vacations and prizes, maybe even a functional working vehicle. That's why I joined. I tell you all that story every Friday. I didn't have a car. I knew that I could, it was easier for me to go all in in the network marketing company to earn a car than it was for me to go to the bank and get out a loan. They don't give loans to everybody. Just saying. And then learning how to build a legacy, working with four people in my organization. Like I signed up four women and I show them what's possible. And we work together and we set goals and we map them out. We're building legacy income here. And then you choose your income at, cap. How many of you work in corporate America? I worked in corporate America for seven years for a financial advisor. At my four-year mark, I got a two-cent raise. Two cents. 0. 0.02. And that was like a big deal. They were like, you got a two-cent raise. I was like, what? Three more years, right before my fourth annual review, I got a 17 cent raise and I thought I had a rad y'all like 17 cents was making moves. And I think about that. And then I think about my plexus income and I think about the work that I put in that felt like fun and it felt like encouragement and personal growth and like all good things. And it wasn't a 17 cent raise. It was thousands of dollars extra a month, hundreds of dollars. And in the network marketing world, I like to create hundred airs. I know millionaire seems a little extreme and maybe far-fetched and there will be some millionaires that are created in network marketing, but hundred heirs. There are families that could just use an extra hundred bucks a month and Plexus can provide that if you're willing to try and do the work. So how do I begin? Well, I'm so glad you asked. You're going to refer some friends. You're going to order your products. We have four different systems, weight loss, gut health, general nutrition, and build your own. Sign up as a VIP. It's $10 to start a Plexus business. You guys, if you want to start a dry bar or if you want to open a franchise, you're looking at $300,000 to $1.3 million to start a business or a franchise. And with the fees and the taxes and the brick and mortar and the leases, all this, it's crazy. You're getting a business for $10. That comes with a customer service department, a 60 day back money back guarantee um, system so that if someone is unhappy, Plexus takes care of it. There is no middleman. It's you and a website link and they order from you. It's you and the relationships and the love that you want to offer your community and the people that place orders. You get excited and you tell a friend. That picture um, in the bottom corner, that's me. And the guy that you saw with the beard, that's actually him without a beard. I know it doesn't look like him, but it's him. He was in the Marine Corps for 10 years. That is my son. I joined when my son was six months old and Scott was deployed to Afghanistan. I missed my husband immensely. I just remember it being the 4th of July and thinking my baby is watching fireworks for the first time and my husband's missing that. Like he didn't get to meet Sterling until he was seven months old. And that was a turning point in my life because I was working it's so hard and I was a full-time college student. And I was thinking to myself, like, there's gotta be more to life. There's just, this, this can't be it. And kind of that same thought you had, Noel, that just, there's gotta be more here. And Plexus allowed me to dream bigger than I've ever dreamed. So look at the referral bonuses up here in the corner. You refer one per person, you're already getting an investment back into your business, $35 back. But look at that 20. The average classroom in America has 17 to 20 students in it. Imagine talking to each parent in your kid's class. Imagine talking to the guys in the break room. Imagine talking, if you're a teacher, right? The teachers have that teacher lounge, the sacred teacher lounge. Like imagine talking to 20 teachers. And y'all all start an accountability group. You go walking before school, right? You're taking your plexus together. You create a community, right? That's $2,200 if you help 20 teachers sign up in the next 30 days. You guys, may you have the courage this week to begin breaking patterns in your life that no longer serve you. Give yourself permission to pause and reflect today. And remember that taking care of yourself doesn't mean me first. It just means me too. I don't know who that quote is from, but I love it so much. And I share with y'all every week because it's so special to me because I was the mom that was on the struggle bus that didn't know how to get off the struggle bus. And I was going to the doctor and literally I would call her like she was my best friend. I'm like, okay, so listen, she's like, Emily, you can't keep calling up here. <laughs> you just need to book an appointment. You can't keep calling. I'm like, but I have this question. 
And she kept telling me that I needed to focus on gut health. And I was like, I don't know what that means. That's like an old people thing. She was like, no, it's not. Just look it up. And then it turned me to a friend who recommended Plexus and they were the gut health company. So I just knew I was onto something. And I hope that you feel like you are about to be onto something too. Thank you guys so much for being here.